What's going on YouTube? My name is Rodham and Easton and welcome back to some Kinko. If you have not seen the previous episode, go watch it right now. Anyways, let's get straight into this video, shall we? Oh, I'll try not to make this extremely long like last episode. If you watched all of that, you're a real one. Thank you so much. And if you didn't, you're not real. It was the last one of our second term. Now that Christmas was right around the corner, today was the last day we could use the school's facilities. The day of the fencing club tournament. <laughs> Are you alright? Karatakahomoi. <laughs> Say I'm sorry. I was glancing at me bitterly. Well, both of us were responsible for this. Between the impact of our first butt-flapping encounter and how engrossed we became in it, we legitimately forgot about this until just a short time ago. Uh, just how late were we going at it last night? Jesus Christ. I remember checking the clock when we were about to take another shower around 1 a.m. So after we finished showering, Ella's freshly cleaned body looked so delectable that I licked her all over and Ella got so hot and bothered she came twice, so we went it for a third time. Good God. Oh? And then after that, wasn't Ella the one who licked me all over next? Then we switched to 6 9 and I came after some anal play. <laughs> she got mad at me and we eventually met up with our fifth round of love. <clears throat> Man, I must have missed that update. Five times in a row? Oh my god. Hold on. What did you like to know? It's nothing really. As a result, we'd gotten very little sleep. I bet I was exhausted after having butt flapping activities in so many different positions last night. <sighs> I think she's more tired of carrying those jugs. Tell her, hey, here, let me hold them for you. Let me help you with some weight off your chest, L quite literally. <laughs> uh, um, about that. She was in poor shape for an entirely different reason. I do think she's over the slump itself, actually. Ella shouldn't have any doubts about devoting herself to fencing anymore. The future wasn't yet set in stone, but she could delicate, delicate, dedicate herself today to this very moment. With the warm-up exercises complete, it was time for everyone to head outside. Those of us in the audience stayed inside. In the audience. Yeah. Oh! Way to ruin the moment. Thank you, Komiya. I don't want your license, dude. Go away. Yes, yes. Thanks for that. That reporter from before was here. A paparazzi chasing Ella. Oh. Around five black suits popped out of nowhere. ママママ、待って、待って。これ、許可証、許可証。あら、記者の方なのね。エルの写真を撮るの? <笑> シルビア様の撮影はそれなりの手順を踏まぬ場合、国際問題に発展しますがよろしいかな。冗談です。僕は1回のスクープより100回の無難な記事で暮らす人間です。私なら撮ってもいいよ。ほれほれ、サービスポ
エロイナディカバレロイスタさんあ,あはい<笑>本日は大変良いお天気で絶好のお日柄ですわあなたの経歴に土がつくにはね A girl with a funny speech pattern is picking a fight with Ellen. I'm surprised too. Now, this had gotten interesting. This old man was gulping. <laughs> Yeah. A strong rival characters popped out of nowhere. Hmm. Couldn't say until she gave it a shot, but had she managed to break out of her slump? I'm only going to assume yes. My worries were. Strike. What just happened? <laughs> Completely needless. She didn't give her a single chance to go on the offensive. Oh, well, thanks for、uh, saying that, Sunny. She was like, all I needed was my dude to give me some butt flapping activity exercises and boom, back into shape. Even better than before, actually. <laughs> What do you mean? Well, yeah, even though I know Nella was strong. It's like you broke free of your slump. よくわかりません。昨日までも自覚はなかったですし、ただ、今日は昨日までより体が迷わず動かせます。だ<笑>、right? <笑>ってそうですよね。That's right. Maybe that massage just did work some magic? バカ。Ella promptly finished her report before heading off. That's it. <laughs> She worked her way through the rest of the competition with ease. Hmm. Ella, busy after this? That was the quickest competition I've ever seen. How? Well, besides the fact that she's a knight and she's dummy strong, like what? I thought it was gonna be like a whole. like a quarter or half of the episode on the competition, but I guess not. Alright, that works for me. It's fine. Don't say you'll just make an appearance. Go have fun. <laughs> Ella and I ended up parting ways following the competition, but. <laughs> I wound up with other business to attend to. What do you mean? Uh, that night. Tagged along and hung out with Sobi for a bit. Ella was off with the fencing club, so I decided to join her. I can't say everything's gone off without a hitch, and Ella still hasn't decided what she wants to do about fencing yet. What? That's pretty huge. Sorry, Sylvia. 
それでも私を選ぶならそれはそれで嬉しいと思うしエルが本格的に競技に打ち込みたいと思うようならそれもすごく嬉しいわ。Yeah, completely agreed with her. Same Ella that had left her birth and environment dictate her life had begun to focus on what she wanted for herself. That was wonderful. s o v i e was similarly all smiles. As for the rest, I felt the same. I wasn't about to lead her in either direction. This was for Ella to decide. I forgot about that.、Mm, yeah. <laughs> She works fast. What do you mean? I'm sorry. <laughs> Why that face? <laughs> She looks so distressed. Oh my god. I guess. <laughs> Sorry, that seriously did work fast. But yeah, Sobi, there's something I'd like clarification on. Nothing good could come from continuing this conversation, and I quickly changed the subject. That's something I wanted to talk to her about anyway. I'd like to ask, but I'm not entirely sure if it's okay to ask. Given her sharp intuition, she pieced it together instantly and grinned at me. <laughs> the way Sylvie always handled things on her own, unique way, was a huge blessing for me. It's easy to bring up even heavy topics. I heard you're adopted. <laughs> no, 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 no. Say what you said earlier in the last episode. Didn't you say she's a hostage? No, no, no. She's a hostage. She's not adopted. Adopted and being a hostage is not the same thing. Anyone that's been adopted, can you can you clarify? Can you verify? I would appreciate it. Sylvia replied indifferently. The idea never really occurred to me, even though you and Mina chan look nothing alike. <laughs> so, yeah. Dog, even I thought the same. Well, kind of. When I first was like, Mina and Sylvia are sisters, they do not really look alike. But I was like, okay, it's anime. They don't, sometimes they don't look the same, so. I don't know. I guess. I guess they're siblings. <laughs> But I never would have thought Ella it was her sister. Her blood sister. Crazy. But it makes so much more sense. Hair color. That's crazy. Wow. So, now, then, to go out of the car, Kim Pats no Watashiga, Sisaki, or Nanoko, so no one of the Yoka, no Yukidoka, no Akashi, not the Idnodakara, Yoshiashine. It is a given that customs varied in different countries, but they say that starts even with a difference in common sense. Maybe this was what that saying meant? That reminds me, you never did call yourself a princess back when we were little. Tozi, Sudani, Sisaki, and Hyde, no, Kimate, Takara. お姫様ではあったのでも私の実感としてはやっぱりまだイスタケの人間だったわねエルのこともお姉ちゃんだと思ってたわ Do you feel differently now? それはそうよエルはもう私の姉じゃない従者よ従者で護衛で一番のお友達 I see They had to eliminate their connection as sisters. That was just how royalty could be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eliminate it, whatever you want, but they're still sisters. But even with that connection cast aside, they both treasured each other all the same. I knew that was true for Ella, but it was a relief that Sylvia agreed. Well, maybe it was a good thing that you didn't call yourself a princess back then. If you had, it might have humbled me. Yeah, maybe. I stuck a finger up her butt. Did it? Isn't that what he did to her? Jesus Christ, she's a, she's a survivor. I did all of that? It was a shame I didn't remember that. What do you mean a shame? Jesus Christ. Alright, Drake. <laughs> Alright, Drake. <laughs> oh, man. Anyways, who are you guys? 
on the on the serious note, not very serious note. Who are you guys siding with, Kendrick or Drake? If, if you say Drake, you're very very wrong. Hmm. That word caught my attention. There really wasn't fighting. それはそうよ。やっぱりエルはお姉ちゃんだもの。最終的にはピアノの上手さで私の方が楽団派にはふさわしいってなったけどね。あの時揉めたのエルは気にしてたみたい。自分に楽団派に属する才能がないから私に
ないおかたでみかん食べながらジョヤの金を聞きたかったのに That sounds rough 冬休み休める日ってあるクリスマスの前日5時間くらい他は1日16時間は動くことになりますね。ロイティは、アウトスタンディング。でも、日本で年末年始したかったわ。年末年始を何か特別に催すという感覚は、ソルティリージュにはありませんからね。欧州ってそうだよね。年越しの瞬間だけ、ハッピーニューイヤーってして、その後は普通な感じ。大晦日とお正月。楽しみたかった。There, there, there, there. It'll be okay. Between her insanely busy work schedule, which was going to put her in an early grave if she wasn't careful, and her lack of free time, she looked distraught. I gave her a gentle pat on the back in an effort to cheer her up. I've got an idea. Let's text each other on New Year's Eve. Compared to Japan, s o r t o l i d g e was across the international date line, and we would be ringing in the new year at vastly different times. We'll text each other in our own respective countries the second it hits midnight. Sounds fun, right? It'll make it easy to see the difference from Japan. For as lackluster an event as it was, it had to be better than nothing. Sylvie so smiled for me. And then. Yeah? まずはレイナも含めての朗報クリスマスにねうちの領時間でパーティーをやるから来られるなら来てちょうだい顔パスにしておくわいいのパーティー Have nothing to wear though 制服で結構ですよドレスが着たいようでしたら貸し出しもしますし What should I do? I'd feel pretty out of place at a consulate party それでもう一つの朗報エルは日本に残すわ For real? Oh, yes, five more rounds. Let's do it. The part I was most curious about actually did come with good news. Hmm. He said, mm, Oh my god, my nose is so itching, so annoying. You're going to continue? Mada wa karimase. Tada, kino katta kara, so de de wari to you no wa do kato. Mada ma yote iru danna no desga. Shirubi sama ga yatta ho ga ito kimete shimate. It was just like so would anticipate every loose end. If I really thought this through, we had talked about having Ella decide whether or not to call it quits after yesterday's competition. But she'd be getting her priorities backwards if she couldn't continue due to her job. It was a teensy bit frustrating that she was staying behind due to her club commitments rather than to be with me. But I was happy so long as I could be with Ella. Alright! <laughs> What are y'all doing? Between that and excitement over winter break, I pulled her in the tight embrace. Ella looked delighted too. It's rare for you to take a proper vacation, isn't it, Ella? So, this is it. 厳密にはこれまではシルビー様がご多忙である以上私も自分から外してきたのですが夕べシルビー様に命じられました恋人になったのだからオールのために使う時間を考えろご営業のためにオールと距離を作らぬように She's a real one Sylvie did that? Sylvie, you really were the perfect one woman 無論私はシルビー様の第一の従者であり、誇りがあります。護衛をおろそかにするつもりはありませんが、オーロと一緒の時間もおろそかにはしません。スクイーズノータイムで抱きつかないでください。You're just so lovable just now. <笑><笑>オーロ、変なところ。おお、おお、おお、おお、へい。I've just been feeling pent up since we didn't get a chance to do it yesterday. <laughs> This is sacred. <laughs> It'll be fine. Come on, let's go down to Pound Town. <laughs> Jeez. Watch it. 
Someone came up to stab me from behind. Not the lesbians again. Thought we were done with those. Oh, it's pretty legit beating. After I got pounded, oh, pause, on a pretty reasonable amount. I think it's the ideal place. What do you mean? Uh, I still had this pain in the neck to deal with. I managed to humor them in some capacity while we were pretend lovers, but I guess it was time to buddy up to the obstacles around Ellen now that we were officially dating. Oh, y'all got caught slipping. That's embarrassing. Now, you know what would have been a, a Sigma move if they just kept going? That's definitely what I would have not done. You're way off. Following that, Ellie got taken away by her friends from club. The fencing club wouldn't be practicing for a while now that the competition was over, but I guess they were going to discuss further club related plans. It would have made things awkward if I stuck around, so I left. Good choice. You didn't even show up to the end of term ceremony. You're not suspended anymore, right? Rio was the same as she always was, even with her winter break on the horizon. Hey there. You kicked the liveliness up another notch today, I see. You're so high spirited, what the heck, man? Give me some of that. Well, I mean. No! Yay! <laughs> Yay, he said. And those who were in the highest of spirits. She's just mad because she hasn't gotten any action. Sorry. I don't blame her. <laughs> Mina chan is. Naturally. Oh, thank God. We're done with you till January. Actually, no. We got probably two or three more routes with this person here. That's a princess for you. <laughs> How about you? That's certainly a modern approach. Minachan would be heading out soon. Beyond that, most of the rich girls in the dorm, starting with Akane-chan, would apparently be heading back home. I guess that means the dorm is gonna be pretty empty for a while, huh? <laughs> Chotto. Don't call me creepy. It just gave me a teensy little erotic mental image, you know? Meh. <laughs> What are you talking about? They just say that without using that weird teen speak nonsense. Her slang usage came so naturally to her that I had trouble understanding her from time to time. Hmm. Ask all you want, but it's only the third day. Although our first date as a couple was nothing but full-on sexy time, our second date was primarily focused on the fencing competition, and today we'd share a brief conversation at school. Annie gripped her biddies. There's nothing interesting enough to tell, really. <laughs> Obnoxious. You shouldn't ask stuff like that. Hmm. It didn't feel right for me to share that information, especially since Ella was involved and it'd be awful if word got out. However, I couldn't deny that I really wanted to brag about it to someone. I guess. I guess. <laughs> She's so stupid. I guess. Gross. <laughs> Why? She flip-flopped out of nowhere. 
ちゃんみたいかな。なんか違うな。<笑> like I care about your sensibilities. If there are fine boobs in front of them, any man would rub them, suck them, and put them in their mouth. <clears throat> Don't make me say it. The conversation veered a little too far in a pervy direction. <laughs> She hit me where it hurts. That was for sure. Sex on our first day was the most we'd associated together. We largely spent our pretend period up until the point on calm events like dates or eating meals together, so there was nothing more to be done. Are、oh, you still here? Oh my god, this is awkward. A very red faced Mina Chan returned and was trying to act like she didn't hear our lewd conversation. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Yes, ma'am. Okay. I wasn't exactly great at this stuff either, you know. Then again, this was probably a case for some male dependability. Sounds awfully short when you put it that way. I had to think this through and take action. This was where my fun times with Ada would begin. Hmm? Ah, good question. I'll have to turn up for a bit on New Year's. Yeah, they're extremely ordinary parents, and our household is peaceful enough that I've never even considered whether we're close or not. It's just, my parents are extremely ordinary. That's fair. What could I do? Nothing. That night. Oh, yes. Due to yesterday's competition? That really was amazing. I'm glad you didn't end up quitting while you're ahead. So, this is me. What does she see more? Yameyo to stay at Tokiwa, Bakuzen to stay in the Stanga. Good, good. Ella had a strained smile. Given Ella's personality, she probably found her current position touchy. Cutting her guard duty short and dedicating more of her time to fencing, an activity she greatly enjoyed, had to be unthinkable for her. To do something she enjoyed, that had to be a questionable scenario for such a diligent knight like Ella. But from a commoner's perspective, that line of thinking was entirely normal. Ella should learn to enjoy life a little more. She's working on it. I'll have to teach you how to have fun, just like we did in bed. Good question. Whoops, did I say that out loud? Come on, you know, we didn't get to do it yesterday after all. I scooted closer towards her. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. All night long at that. Yeah. Oh. Ella? No! No! Huh? You mean we're not gonna have sex again? What? But, well, no, it's not like that's what I was angling for, but we've done it once already. Actually, can you hold out? I was exhausted by the fourth round, but you kept on saying, more, more. <laughs> She's so. <laughs> I like her. I like her attitude towards this. It's so funny. Makes it even better. Ah, sure. 
This was my impression now that we had done it. I loved it. I really loved it. And once we got started, we went at it like rabbits until we were exhausted. We were in the highest of spirits during. But when I considered how rough it was afterward, maybe we should show some level of restraint. Oh, that reminds me. Were you okay at the competition yesterday? We did it so much I was ready. We're still weak in the knees. Were you all right? Stamina wise? <laughs> Should have expected as much. If it doesn't wear you out, then shouldn't it be fine? But for good reasons. If I run myself right doing it with you, that's a life I can be satisfied with. That <laughs> was stubborn. Absolutely. When you took the risk of pregnancy and whatnot into consideration, then yeah, what she was saying was correct. She was correct, but something fell off when she rejected it this distinctly. I was confident that we had spent a great night together the other day. Did something happen? <laughs> when I asked, she was hesitant to answer. It sounded like something had come up. Why is it off limits all of a sudden? Something bothering you? <sighs> ah, her face screamed that she didn't want to be asked. If that were the case, then I needed to pry it out of her. If I backed off now, then sex would seriously be taken off the table indefinitely. If something worries you, tell me. You shouldn't keep secrets. Uh-huh. Really? I looked straight into her eyes. We're lovers, aren't we? Are you keeping a secret from me? It was a bit sneaky of me, but I took her head on. Secrets weren't too big of a deal even if we were lovers, but Ella was such an honest person that if I put it this way, She spoke. That's the spirit. It makes me happy too. What fetish? Huh? Fetish? Yes! <laughs> <laughs> what? How it turned out to rape? Oh my god. Right. I knew this was a pure love game. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh nah, rape fetish. Oh man. That's uh that's that's crazy. Huh? そのために両熟についても色々と勉強しました。ああいうゲームの内容はあなたに入っています。しかし、しかし、嫌がる相手にしたいという性癖はですね、とどめておくべきだとですね。ああ。I Maybe it would actually be better to put it to use for now? <laughs> if you figured me out, that's a tough break. That I just love it so much. Take this. I'm gonna assault you. Oh, no, no, no. Hey, careful. I made a move on her. I pushed her back onto the bed. This sexual assault business aside, I could tell she was a little turned on after I pushed her down. Hey yo, that's strike two, my guy. I can't, I cannot support this. What's going on here? Isn't doing it when you shouldn't what makes it rape? Come on, come on, come on. Time for some. Oh my god. No, 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 no. I reached for her bitty. Dash. Huh? Ella disappeared from beneath me. In the same instant, I was pinned down against the futon. Ow! Ah! She twisted my arm with all of her strength. I was right. Ella was considerably strong when it came to fencing too, but she was a master when it came to martial arts and apprehension techniques. Whether I did it or not was never a factor, and you try to rape a knight. She wasn't someone I was strong enough to violate against her. Well, either way. Yeah, auto rape is wrong. What are you doing? I get it, I get it. Stop! Bruh. I thought you were about to clear it up, not say that you are a raper. She 
she let me go. Huh. It's been a while since I thought my arm was gonna get ripped off. Mm -hmm. Uh, listen. I got the general idea of her misunderstanding and I immediately cut to the chase. Oh, we should have done it sooner. Yes, I do love those sort of games, but that doesn't mean it's my fetish. Look over here. I've got plenty of pure love games here, too. If I were to make it easier to understand, I love you, Alip, but I love Sylvie and Reina, too. Also, Rhea, and I guess Jokasaki, we were talking looks wise. However, you're the only partner I want to have sex with. Mm. It's like that. I like the fictional idea of it, but that doesn't mean it's something I want to do in real life. I don't know if that makes it any better, dude. My explanation was a little overbearing, but she appeared to understand. By the way, given how this conversation went, the fact you have doubts that I might assault someone must mean you suspect I might have sex with someone other than you, even though you're my top choice. Ella, do you think I might cheat on you? Then trust me, I won't have sex in any way that makes you sad, Ella. <laughs> That's Imagine this question without any like what's the freaking without context this is <laughs> you're not gonna sexually assault me nope nope her knowledge was beyond skewed It's not like she believed me. I was glad. Ella was so straightforward that as long as we had a logical conversation, even if she had doubts, we could avoid pointlessly dragging things out. By the way, I steered the conversation in the direction I had wanted to go. You mentioned doing research on the subject earlier? How did you study it, exactly? Uh, her face turned bright red. Bingo, time to score some sweet, sweet info. Hey, hey, how did you study it? What did you study from and in what form did you study it? I've actually had my suspicions for a while now. You can be uptight, but you know sexual terms like French kissing and whatnot. You wouldn't use words like French kissing except in sexually related instances, you know? Just plain kissing would suffice in ordinary conversation. It only came up and worked separate in the erotic category. Which meant... What kind of studying did you do, Ellison? <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> she ran off. Oh man, I love Ella. Ella's sudden ban on sex had confused me a little. But it did sound like it would be fine as long as I made sure it wasn't all I focused on. So this wasn't extreme enough to warrant warning of me. Ella's body wasn't the only thing I loved about her after all. Although she was ridiculously hot. True, true, true that. The first day of winter break. Yeah, I think that's really great. Even though Mina-chan had left, I was still early to rise today. Nobody would come to wake me up starting tomorrow so I could sleep in the morning. And I was thankful for that. The foundation of any extended vacation was lounging around until it was past noon. Now that's good, I'm glad. I hope we don't do it again. <laughs> It'll be lonely for me too. <laughs> No, thank you. Winter break was in full swing. <sighs> Why are you awake this early? She looked even more surly than normal. Surly? Hmm? She 
She muttered something under her breath, but I couldn't hear it. Huh? Hmm, sure. Really? If it's only a week, I might still be at the dorm. But if this is the last, then have a happy new year. Oh. Ryo was acting kind of strangely. She did look put off, but also like she didn't mind so much. What could she have planned over Christmas? What's going on? It was around 10 a.m. I promised to pick up Ella around this time and this entire estate was all a bustle. But what? The old man was rushing around like crazy. And then he rushed his way straight back and... Thank you. <laughs> What are you doing? Everyone was running all over. She was. She was. So You've got it wrong. Also, you got that information from Sobi, didn't you? Morning. Huh? We headed in the town together. All of, all of the running around they were doing aside, didn't things seem kind of hectic at the estate? With Sylvie out and about, I would have figured those at the estate would have a chance to settle down. Oh yeah. I guess Sobi had mentioned that the other day too. A get together? What kind? Ah. Sound like a mature gathering of sorts. Didn't quite seem like the same idea as the party Sylvie so had been talking about. They obviously wouldn't invite us to a party like that. Actually, Ella, you're going to stay with me on Christmas, right? I'd much sooner be with Ella than go to some party. Nice. Made my life easier having such a thoughtful princess around. There's no way around it. That's just the difference in positions. Hmm? So who's taking part in the event too? Ah. So his forte, huh? That would double as an easily recognized welcome and as a way to rile up the party. No reason not to, for sure. Oh? A Japanese singer? Interesting. Maria Bishop? For real? Maria Bishop will be at the party? Ele Onichan, I have a request. I don't know, that's a good question. I'm sorry that I had to read that too. You guys deserve better. Why are you making that face? I got Ella to fill me in some more. The party, so we mentioned, and the mature gathering Ella alluded to earlier were one and the same. I immediately gave the okay. All right. Oh, come on. This means I'll get to hear Maria Bishop sing live. 
She was being invited in place of a tenor singer. That had to mean it was safe to assume she was going to sing. I nearly ascended to heaven from the single time we met before, but this was my chance to hear her perform live. Given Sylvie's connections, maybe I could even talk to her again? Woohoo, jackpot. What's wrong with that? Ele? Well, yeah, I'm a huge fan of hers. <laughs> huh? Oh? Where did the stormy mood come from? Ele? Are you jealous? <laughs> Her face. Aww. I like this Ellie. <laughs> no, no, that's totally unrelated. I'm in love with you, but I'm just a fan of hers. Huh? This is quickly turning into pain. Have you never been a fan of anyone? Several hundred years ago. That didn't exactly fit in the same category. Ella's diehard tendencies have shown themselves, huh? Oh well, the side of her was cute, I agree, so it was fine by me. I don't mean like that. Um, I know. You love Sobi, right? That's roughly the idea, how I feel about Maria. Did that help her to understand? I don't think so. If I had to put it another way, I do love her, but... Oh, mistake. I would never... Squeeze. I hugged her. I want to do anything like this to her. I want to do this with you all the time, though. That's the sort of difference I mean. Does that make sense? Her expression was a little sus, but... Touch, touch. Pat on the butt distracted her. Yep. Pat the butt to get the jealousy away. Nice, nice. I'm glad. Looks like I managed to downplay this successfully. I don't know, did you? Hey, yo. Not only are you my number one, you're my only one. I had more of a jealous streak than I had gave her credit for. That side of her was pretty cute too. Alright, we're gonna wrap it up here. That was a nice way to end it, right? Nice way to end the episode. I wouldn't think so. Well, I think this was a pretty solid episode. It was not thing like the last episode. Last episode was a whole, last episode was a whole different story, man. Man. But I still love this episode. We had the rain a moment. We had the Ella being jealous moment, which is very, very cute. Uh, we had her beating the competition like it was nothing. Even though I thought it was going to be like most of the episode, it literally did not last for crap. I was very, very shocked about that. Um, what else? What else? <clears throat> I, oh, something that I've said before, and I'm going to say it again. I really like when Sylvie and Odo have talks at the little tea setting thing. It's just so nice. I don't know about it, but I feel like it's such a vibe. Yeah. Y'all know what I mean? No? Okay, too bad. Well, that's all I got to say about this episode. We're getting very, very close to the end of this, Drew. I'm actually very distressed about that. I'm really sad about that, but it's been great. It's been really great. Still enjoying it. It's been fun. It's been amazing. Love Ella. I love Ella so much, but I'm going to leave it at that. I'm going to wrap it up here. Thank you so much for watching this video. I appreciate it a lot. It means the absolute world to me. Thank you. I really, really, really do hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please let me know by hitting that like. And if you have not subscribed and you made it this far already, subscribe, please. You won't regret it. And I'll see you guys on the next video. So stay safe. And as always, until next time, guys. Oh, one last thing. Who do you think is the best girl and why? And if your reason has any spoilers, I would appreciate it if you kept it to yourself. At least for now, because I'm still not done with this game. But I would like to hear what you guys think. Anyways, later guys.